Hello, Penny Wright here with my Hummingbird Duo project, Cat and Mouse. If I were starting this type of project with a, an authentic class of learners or for teacher professional development training, I would start with an open-ended creative project, much the way that we did for class. This is a great way to introduce computer science concepts and computer programming and coding. A lesson plan I drafted was geared for 5th through 8th graders. The focus was computer science and technology. I found that this type of project met most of the ISTE student standards. However, it wouldn't have to be completely open-ended. This is easily adaptable to an ELA class at, of any age level. Students could create any character from any book they've read. And social studies and history applications come to mind. Students could exemplify a famous historical figure or any event in history. Let's take a closer look. As you can see, my cat uh, has glowy, glowy eyes. If I swing over here to my scratch program, I actually have two lines of code, one for the tricolor LEDs and the other for movement. After a momentary adjustment, let's take a look at that one more time. Here is my scratch program. I have one line of code that is controlling the tricolor LEDs and another line of code controlling the movement. We've got arm movement catching the mouse and a little bit of head movement. Let's take a closer look behind. One of the, our, one of the uh, servos is controlling the head movement and down below there is a second servo that's controlling the arm movement. Of course, I've got the tricolor LEDs hooked up to the microcontroller. I hope that you enjoyed my first Hummingbird Duo project, and we'll talk to you again next time.